brought in a number of different varieties of cheese from a company called Beehive Cheese. Uh, I believe this one's out of Utah. It's an award-winning cheese company. Uh, we have many different flavors. The ones that we are going to be eating today are a flavor called Pour Me a Slice. So that's a cheese with whiskey infused in it, which is kind of fun. And also the um, rubbed with lavender and espresso beehive cheese. It also comes in sea hive, which is rubbed with sea salt and honey. And um, Big John's Cajun with secret Cajun recipe. It's a secret, it's a secret. I just tried a little bite of the pour me a slice. It's infused with Basil Hayden's bourbon. I will tell you, as a whiskey lover, personally I would like it to have a little more whiskey flavor, but that can be also a good thing because if you're not a whiskey lover, yeah. it's not overpowering at all. It's just, it's a really nice balanced cheese. It's not, it's not really pungent, it's, uh, but it's got plenty of flavor. Yeah. It's pretty tasty. Because I'm not a bourbon lover, and I think it just sort of adds a little bit of richness. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna have my next little piece of cheese on these um, water crackers. They're from Charrington. Your pretty standard water cracker. Um, so I'm gonna try the barely buzzed, uh, rubbed with espresso and lavender from Beehive Cheese. And I will say, we, we tried uh, a little bit of this before, and because I'm such a fan of big, big flavors, I found this subtle as well. Mm -hmm. um, you, you definitely get a little bit of both, a little bit of the espresso, a little bit of the lavender, but it still mostly tastes like cheese, which mm -hmm. I think is the point. Like, you know. It's, want... it's nicely balanced, it's not overly floral. No. The lavender is just a very, um, it's just a little fun hint. Mm -hmm. It's quite good. 